Meet Gerald, a business owner who runs a large commercial space downtown. He's a busy guy, managing a team of employees and running a business. Lately, he's been receiving complaints from his workers about poor lighting. Some areas of the office are too bright, have glare, and others are too dim, and it's impacting productivity. A client even referred to the conference room as antiquated and cited a need to relight the entire space. Employee accidents are on the rise, and with his hands full, Gerald needs help. Gerald's property manager, Lauren, wants to retain Gerald as a tenant, so it's important to her that his needs are met. Now the two are planning renovations in three key areas. The open office, where Gerald's employees work, the conference room, where Gerald meets with his clients, and Gerald's private office, where he does all his thinking and meets with his team. The first area they focused on was the open office. Open floor plans with no or low partitions are trending. Decision makers are leaning toward modular and reconfigurable spaces for the dynamic office environment. In order to accommodate new employees, Gerald and his team often need to redefine the boundaries and re-engineer the spaces, and the lighting system needs to be just as flexible. However, it's challenging to deliver light across partitions and use lighting to delineate spaces undefined by physical boundaries. The second area was the conference room. Here, Gerald meets face-to-face -face with clients, brainstorms and collaborates on the whiteboard, and hosts presentations, webinars, and conferences. Lauren knows that tenants like Gerald need lighting that works with each of these tasks, and along with it, user-friendly controls and occupancy sensors that maximize space, flexibility, and energy efficiency. Lastly, Gerald's office. This is where Gerald does all his best thinking, holds small meetings, and crafts proposals. Daylight harvesting and occupancy sensing are effective tools to make sure the light quality is always optimal for Gerald's task and device. And how would Gerald and his employees get to and from these spaces without corridors? In this space, intelligent control can deliver optimal light based on the amount of daylight and traffic to keep the employees safe and eliminate avoidable accidents. Luckily, this smart lighting system wasn't hard for Lauren to implement. She works with Bob, a knowledgeable lighting solutions provider. Bob was able to offer a comprehensive package of lighting and controls from a single manufacturer, Acuity Brands. Because all of Acuity's luminaires and controls are tested for quality and compatibility, installation was a breeze, and the solution is future-proof to allow for continual change as Gerald's business reorganizes and expands. Gerald is impressed with smart lighting, and he's curious about what else might be possible. Bob informs him that Acuity offers a complete solution for unifying lighting, HVAC, shades, access control, and energy management. Based on truly open standards, the innovative, cost-effective building and energy management system simplifies building control by using a single platform and works with existing building systems, ensuring interoperability and making the facility ready for the Internet of Things. Acuity solutions help customers lower energy and operational budget while creating a comfortable, healthy and productive work environment. The best lighting systems begin with a real understanding about where and how real people work. Like Gerald, who's happy to announce that business is booming and he's signing a four-year lease extension.